Hi, this is James playing 26 flagship mod for C uh, Zo C E, and you're witnessing me make a whole bunch of needlessly stupid mistakes over and over again, which is why I keep losing this game with the NGB. Uh, the first game, I don't even remember what I did wrong, but it was whatever it was, it was stupid. Um, in the second, oh no, in the first game, I just got fried by an asteroid field right away. Um, I did something else stupid as well. The second game I did something stupid. Ooh, nice generous pride. I'll take it and leave well enough alone because I don't have any extra crewmen yet. Uh, in the second game, oh yes, I encountered the, the in-production flagship and needlessly attacked it. Ugh. Hacker. Okay, we're good. Um, it had two shields and I couldn't penetrate it because I never found any weapons yet. And in the third game, I could have gone to a store by going to an empty beacon first, but instead I did the exceedingly stupid choice of going to a full beacon anyway, which killed me. Um, so. Every single one of these has been entirely not this ship's fault, I would say, except maybe the first game, but that was even better. No, this, it wasn't the ship's fault, it was my fault and bad playing. Is the reason for how bad we have been doing so far. So I'm hoping to rectify that, this game, by making less stupid mistakes. Let's see if I learn anything. Oh, interesting. So I accepted the surrender of this AI and it gave me a whole bunch of things in an advanced navigation AI. Unfortunately, um, the sentient internal AI that this, ship's com this ship comes with or readily does at least part of the function of an advanced navigation AI. Uh, true, it doesn't make you be able to teleport to previously be visited beacons, so that's something new. Nevertheless, there is some lost functionality, which is too bad. I mean, I could just sell it, get some money, we're good. Ha ha, I don't have any weapons. <laughs> Ooh, ouch. I'm not going to be able to block anything anyway, so let's just get moving. The repair zone. All right, the repairs are done, and we're moving along. Maybe I should get a power at this point, but we'll see. Somebody wants a mercenary ship. Ooh, and they give me five. <laughs> Can I even get there? Um, yeah, I'm not going to try going there. Let's see, this exit can go to two different places. I think I want to be at this one when I get to the exit. So I'm going to keep that in mind in terms of my jumps. The first one I need to go is here. Okay, let's get our first crewman. We're going through this again. Yes, yes we are. Because this is a good strategy. Now, I have six jumps to make. One, two, three four, five, six. That works out just fine. Uh, this guy has a nasty looking artillery laser that's going to penetrate my shields. So, almost certainly taking some damage here unless I'm so lucky as to have... Oof. Enemy miss, which did not happen. Let's open fire. No, it's not having any of it. Well, got 
Gotta get out of here. Alright. Moving along. Eight damage sustained so far. Big nasty flak here. Supported by a little laser. Ouch. Ouch. Please kindly die. There we go. Here's the one power you've been waiting for. I don't have time to search for a rebel ship because if I have the fleet double their speed once, I'm screwed. I'll happily get a civilian ship. Maybe I can even aid this one without being killed. There we go. With the weapons down, we are safe. Or sorry, with this laser down, we are safe, very specifically. Well, temporarily. Ouch. Ah, looks like that hit started a fire into that nonsense. Sadly, the civilian ship didn't help me out much. I need scrap. Eight scrap isn't much, but oh well. Ha 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 I can go to the auto-controlled sector again if I want. Um, I learned my lesson last time. Let's not do that. <laughs> Let's try and play one round where we don't do something stupid. Just one. I still hear fire, so let's try this again. And that's why I keep my sound on while playing this game, because... No matter what... Listening to what's going on will always help you. Since we're in a quarantine sector, having medbay level 2 is a big help. Level 3 even better, because it'll unlock some blue options for some of the... Some of the battles. Additionally, in this sector, I actually can afford to lose crew because I can basically produce them at will. Let's open fire. Okay, my NG has just left. Do I care? No! Because <laughs> now I can do this. No more oxygen on board. Oh. And you can do that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. So again, was it worth 24 scrap and 2 fuel to take 2 extra points of damage? I say absolutely. I could have ended the fight earlier, but I didn't. So now that we have an AI only ship, I can take advantage of the no oxygen situation or oxygen where I want. We'll be looking for a store. We've got intruders on board. How convenient. Interesting. Why is this why does this place actually still have oxygen in it? I don't understand. 
don't expect that our opponents are going to last very long in either case, in any case. I mean the borders specifically. Oh dear. Fire. I guess that's not actually going to do much to me, is it? Ouch. That will, however... That kind of bad luck causes me to lose games. Ouch. Well, come on, man. That's just lame. Stupid mind control. You start this repair all over again. Only to get my shields taken down. All right, I need someone on the shield fixing. Thankfully, enemy's weapons have been taken down. Let's see, now we're gonna need some repairs. Got a light defense drone. Well, that at least helped me meaningfully by being able to resist some uh, missiles. If we can find a store that helps us stay alive. <laughs> also another reason to potentially upgrade my, my um, drone power by one. Let's see what's near us first. No stores. And drone power doesn't cost that much. I'll go to a distress beacon first. Okay, here there is... I'll send in a security steam and nothing happens. Okay, I'm going to go for here. Why? Because I want to expose three more potential places where we might find an actual store. Hmm, our weapon systems are malfunctioning and we're too afraid of pirates to travel home unassisted. Can you escort us? Yes, I'll take some fuel. Quest marker added way over here. All right, so once again, I'm not seeing any stores, so I'm going to pick this beacon so I can expose these two. I'll aid a civilian ship and hope that I don't get killed. Okay, so there is an ion cannon here. Not anymore. So we're safe, I think. This scythe beam will cut eventually, but it's not gonna get through our shields, so we're okay. And there it goes. It's done and Ion cannon is taking a shot. Miss. Wonderful. Let's see what the civilian ship can give me for help. Okay, good. Two stores right there. Um, if I go here. Now how many jumps do we have? We have nine jumps so far. So if we start with this store. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So how about we go to the store and purchase some disease samples or something. Oh, trading is fast here. Well, whatever. So I'm going to sell this to take the disease samples. All right. So let's see what kind of weaponry we have here. There is a Vulcan cannon, um, which is rather excessive for my requirements to say the least a leaking system repair drone a hull repair drone a light defense drone a weapon pre-igniter that will not help me okay so what do I want to do here I'm gonna buy either the blast stunner or the burst scatter laser or even both The Blast Stunner has more longevity for its shield takey downiness. 
fix all our hit points. I'm almost tempted to buy this leaking system to repair drone, but that's another energy I do not have. So I'll stick with that. At last we have something that can support our drone. So I'm quite content with that. Oh, who knew that I would find another store on the very next jump? Um, there's nothing here. For all I know, that was gonna that was gonna include a complete healing of all my d damage. Well, whatever. No, I've learned my lesson from asteroid field. I'm not doing that. One more AI. Oh, no. All I did from that was lose 15 bucks. That's just called bad luck. These guys seem to be more experienced than I am fighting. Not impressed with their attempt to take up my weapon system. What the heck? My dude is dying so fast. I guess my weapon system is going to take a damage no matter what. Sigh. Okay, one opponent is down. I, I have to imagine that these these borders have plus two um, combat strength or something because my guys are just getting murdered as soon as they get into the square. Okay, there we go, finally. So yeah, there is always a chance that your AI can backfire. Uh, just if you didn't know, now you do. Okay. Well, I mean, that was exciting in this sort of arduous way. Slaver scum, grr. always being so difficult fighting these opponents is these double lasers and a general lack of oh come on why do you have to hit the shields I suppose my ion stunner isn't going to really do much in this fight at least his weapon was slowed down momentarily Time for another power bar. Well, I got a new NG, which sort of necessitates keeping the oxygen up, I guess. I think it's worth a power to keep an NG around because that'll help me heal quicker. Sorry, repair quicker, is what I meant to say. Okay, and an improved med bay got me a new human guy. What, I'll put him on the shields? Because, you know what? I'm not even going to put him on shields. I'm going to put him on weapons. Because that blast downer could come in handy. Finally, we're going to the exit. One jump early, but that's how it goes. Can aid a civilian. Uh, we don't need the stunner for this fight. Ouch. How unkind. Took down the stunner that I didn't need. And the civilian ran away. 
Well, civilian sector or abandoned sector? Where do the disease samples need to go? AI, civilian, or Zoltan? How about we go to the civilian sector then and find a store? Fleet delayed. We can get one more AI. There we go. I'll put this guy on doors. Uh, we have enough crew for me to be satisfied right now. Anyway, okay, there's a store right there. I'm not going to go to it on my first jump because I think I want a few more scrap than I have already. Even after I sell uh, the thing that I want to sell. Okay, so now we're going to need this ion, this ion, uh, sorry, blast stunner for sure. Where is? Going to take my down my oxygen. Don't care. So I'll need our stealth drone up here. And there we go. With the shields down a point, I can actually use my drone to penetrate his stuff. And I'm probably going to put up my light defense drone because I don't want to be hit by that thing that's coming right now. There we go. I'm going to let my drone recharge first. Ooh. I'll accept and fire on them. Wonderful. And my crew's accepting it. The murderous, cruel, unkind things of them. Ouch. Is it worth 31 scrap for the three damage I just took? Yep. Absolutely. Oh, there's another store. I'm gonna go to this store just because I got one more jump to make, or two or even more, two more jumps to make scrap out of this. I'll attack this ship to get to a storage cache. As you can see, there's a missile weapon here and a nasty Pranach beam. I hate these things. Okay, time to block some more. Ooh, light defense drone is down. Ouch. Doesn't work, supposed to work that way. Found nothing useful, too bad. The 28 scrap and the three or four damage I just took. Um, two drones, it's 12, 28. I maybe gained eight scrap from that. That was a lousy deal. Yeah, I can still come around and up. Let's see, five jumps. I'm gonna really squeeze out every dollar I can right now. Problem, of course, still being my lack of actual weapons. Oh, my drone kindly takes out the shields. I can maybe ionize the weapons and keep them from firing on me too much. No such luck. That's right, I'm safe now. There we go. What just happened here? Oh, I lost some power. I am getting low on drones. So sooner or later, I'm gonna have to come up with, there's another store, geez. Um, yeah, let's go with the plan I just originally started with. Ooh, I can buy some fuel for cheap, good. All right, now we're gonna, let's sell our disease samples. It's for 90 scrap, actually 85. So it's a it's an about uh, about 95 scrap. So drone recovery, or I will solve all our drone problems. Done. Um, won't need to worry about that anymore. Now here we have a charge laser for a power of three. That will definitely go through enemy shields. We have a cluster bomb, which only requires one power. And I do have a lot of missiles. And a hull repair, which also requires missiles. Um, first of all, let's fix ourselves up. I cannot afford both of these. That's not entirely true. If I sell the ion stunner, I can. And you know what? I like that. 
I want the bomb much more than I want um, the ion stunner. So it was short-lived, but I think it did its job. So my next, I'm going to have two plans decked. I want to get my shields up and I want to get my weapons up. So that's my short-term plan because I'm sick of having everything penetrate my shields. Um, human crew. Ooh, there's somebody that's hiding from the rebels. Oh, in the next sector, I see. Uh, so I got six-ish jumps. One, two, three, four, five, something like that. Okay. All right, now that I conveniently have a, um, what is it? Drone, drone recovery thingy. I don't need to be worried as much about using up my drones. And if I really feel like the enemy's weapons are too dangerous, I can just cluster bomb them. I have that option now. So I'm not in a hurry. Ooh, lots of fuel. Let's open fire. No such luck. All right, that's that. Moving along. So you got my drones back. <sighs> asteroid field again. No. I wouldn't recommend going into an asteroid field without two shields. It's just suicide. Improve my reactor. Okay. Wish I'd upgraded it one more before then, but oh well. One, two, three. That's my plan. Okay, so... So let's see. This is mind control of only level one, so he's gonna shoot me a little bit. That's fine. That'll stop his mind control. Question is, what of mine gets hit? Now I'm gonna throw a cluster bomb into the weapons. Ouch. Or he will kill my weapons before I have a chance. That was irritating. Because we're looking at mere moments before that would have worked. And his pike beam is still active. Ouch. Come on, come on. Ouch. We're really getting walloped here. Okay, our opponent is trying to get away. seemed to me like the sound of that bomb is malfunctioning or something. But maybe it was because of all the ionization or something. I don't know. Alright, one. But if there is a malfunction, it's probably not a difficult fix. Okay, here. I mean, obviously the shields have got a goal. Lots of nasty weapons coming my way. Ouch. Okay, no, that, that sounded right. Alright, so my weapons are going to be down, and that's that. And even after all that, being hit three times, still no luck being able to cut through. Because our opponent has four shields, I'm getting ripped apart. This is why you should I should have probably upgraded my shields much earlier than I did. So one more loss at the NGB. Sigh. I am sad. One more try? Okay.